Welcome back guys, CryptoFolly channel. Today I would like to show you the updates for RPL, Rocket Pool with my custom maker set. Let's dive in. First of all guys, uh, you should take a look on fundraising rounds. So uh, I'm more than sure that people who invested on private rounds or on ICO in 17, sound 17, already out of, uh, with a profit from that token in sound 21. So here's a chart uh, crypto. RPL USD crypto, so this is global chart. So uh, private round uh, 2017, then listing Jewel 18 at uh, 92 cents. And uh, imagine the profit uh, while the token in November 2021 hit $59 and then sweep that high in April 2023. So it's uh, amazing. It's amazing, right? Also, this is one of the uh, greatest examples uh, how the token perform uh, during all altcoins uh, dying, you know. Uh, this token, since um, June 2022, already made 769% gains and dump it again uh, to almost the same low. So that's why, guys, uh, imagine um, someone hop into that token here at uh, $60 and now it's trade around $11 and... Um, I don't know why the people hop in at the top. So always buying in the accumulation zones. So what is kind of bad? Uh, we didn't sweep that uh, lows. And uh, we didn't sweep it. So this is low June 21. We didn't sweep it in June 22 after the year. So it's kind of bad because uh, the more we uh, came to some K level, the more chances we were breaking out that level. So this is not a playing out like support, more strong support. So the more we test some level, the that level become weaker, not a stronger. So that's the case. And uh, we are not so far from that low. And that low is around $7. If we take a look, the monthly gaps, so we can mark this uh, monthly favorable gap. Uh, it starts uh, like $7.72. $7 and uh, fulfill it's around $4.48. Uh, honestly, I hope, I hope we will not drop to that low now uh, and just hold the line, you know, and bounce, go into maybe new all-time high. And after that, come back and uh, drop it uh, under that K level in zone 26 to zone 27. Uh, but just in case, guys, I'm more than real to see the drop under uh, $7. So just be, be ready for that one. Also, if we use the FIB on the line chart like this one, so I count the top, this is pure support, bounce, a 38 level by FIB uh, by uh, line chart. Here we trade inside the accumulation zone, uh, but everything uh, more than real to see that sweep. And uh, take a look, this is a test of 0 0.5 level by FIB uh, by week, if we count from the body of the candle, but if we count the FIB by weeks, here, the fulfill will be exactly the 27 block. So that that's a problem, right? So this is a top, this is support, bounce, 38 level by FIB, 38 level by FIB, collapse it down, and we didn't test it even that uh, zone. So it's kind of scary, you know, because uh, if we will dump after that correction like this one, or uh, now from this current price, it's gonna be pretty, pretty bad because we can dump like 59% more or at least 44% uh, more. I hope we will not drop that low, guys, but we got a factor, so we got a uh, liquidity pool under, so basically equal lows. We got a mm, not traded monthly gap. It's also the magnet. So ju just in case, guys, just be ready for that potential drop. Uh, if you want to accumulate uh, RPL, so this is a zone for accumulation. So uh, we can mark, let's turn on the uh levels price levels that one so it's uh eight dollar fifty and four dollar twenty eight so this is a accumulation zone for rpl can we drop of course lower than december so many of course we can guys easily just easily to two dollar but uh, the zone for accumulation now not <laughs> that time period is. so that guys now in uh in losses like 85 percent in losses so it's a, it's a madness but it's a, just one more lesson so why you have to uh take a profit all the time you know distribute in zone of distribution and um accumulate in zone of accumulation um maybe maybe uh, we'll see a 92.77 new all-time high uh, because we can form the 
three drives pattern basically if uh, this is a one touch this is a second touch if we form the extend lines uh right this one uh it's of course uh, hard to uh say when you know so based on that uh, trend line it can be like in uh, october 32 some 32 but i don't think so uh that's why if we use the line chart uh, on the monthly time frame it's uh, weird because uh, look on the weekly time frame this is the highest point right on the monthly time frame this is the lowest point so sometimes uh, all that uh, data what we got on the chart it looks so complicated right so how would it even possible so that line chart on the weekly the higher than uh, um, that low high but uh, on the monthly that high is lower than the previous one so it's kind of weird that's why uh, there are million traders analyze all of that uh, charts in different ways and only the time will show us uh, which one uh, analysis is correct so uh, the main goal is not to be always right the main goal is always um, to be uh, right personal for yourself and for your uh, risk management and money money management so that's the point so if you made a right decision personal for you to buy now for example at that low and bounce and sell at 12 dollar it's okay so it's your decision and it's the right decision can be so it's hard to say are we hit a new all-time high or not so based on that FIB, yes $40.37 is going to be only the correction so take a look this is a current circulation supply and basically 100% coins in circulation supply so no new seller pressure or so also interesting moment the coinbase venture investor in the zone way three in the, that token that's why guys so uh, this is a uh, uh, circular supply so let's say for $30 $30 it's 828 uh, million market cap will be but uh, the highest point of the market cap being here around uh, april zone way three around 1 billion so 92 dollar uh, 77 it's i think it's uh, more than real to see 92 77 around uh, 93 i guess 94 95 96 97 it's going to be 2 billion market cap so guys more than real to see 2 billion market cap for rpl if you believe in the 139 139 let's say it's uh, around 2.8 billion market cap also more than real so just uh, just in case but take a look if we count from this current price the gains will be not so big right so it's going to be only like 700 million market 700 um, percent this is going to be one thousand percent but if we count from that correction if we will dump it's going to be totally another numbers so it will be three thousand percent gains and uh, around two thousand percent gains so that's a point when the token dump lower uh we will see not so big gains you know by price but it will be the big, big gains by a percentage uh, depends of your entry average entry that's why guys uh this is a zone for accumulation uh, monthly gaps on uh, bullish one uh, also we added so this one anyway uh, we will come back and test it that one this one is already tested and this one so around 0 0.5 level by FIP. so anyway sooner or later i think if we will see and i think we will see the altcoin season uh this is a, just a local target so 11 18 26 and uh, 43 78 but uh be careful because of that token now uh, listed on the uh, binance futures and all the time uh, that listing can be can be like a trigger for sell uh, also by seasonality in september you know before the probably probably the good and green uh, uh, october let's take a look with uh, my customer Kersa, what i will do now uh, with that token now on the weekly so all that time period being a uh, distribution here's uh, probably the fake pump right because a um, pump but without a signal to sell and crazy dump 85 percent so this is a accumulation zone again a uh, monster time frame mm, would be good to see the drop again down so adz i can't show you on that uh, ticker uh, take a look market mode yes it's good so a free a free now we come back to capitulation disbelief zone it's good uh monthly even the monthly time frame we're in this belief so it's good it's more bullish than bearish so i highly recommend to track all of that data on the high time frames you know 
to track the uh, sentiment around uh, what's going on with the wealth position. Uh, pure, pure signals to out and fix that profit here. One, then fix again, fix profit, wealth out of that token dump. Uh, every side there is the wear and see here is a top, not exactly at that candle. So that's what the signal to out of that token in May. Uh, MACD bearish the wear and see and uh, wealth out of that token. So that's the case. Uh, monthly, now we lay down at the bottom, but without a money inflow. Step by step on the weekly, uh, the wheels accumulate, but not a big portion of their position. Uh, trade on, trade on, it was uh, here. Sell, sell, buy back, sell, 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 buy back. So last signal to sell being here in uh, April is only three. Here we get a signal to buy back, but without its main signal to buy. Uh, monthly time frame, uh, no signal to buy. Uh, less than the take profit. Monthly, no data. And uh, weekly, what is good? We trade under final price. So take a look. The last time when we dump it under final price, we bounce it, uh, like I showed you, almost 800%. Now we dump it also under from a value of that token, right? So it would be good to see some test sweep of that lows, retest it, and going higher. Two, take profit line on the weekly now, 39.61. Exit line 44.60, daily time frame, here. Uh, for the middle wall of the talking, it's $7.76, uh, uh, but with weak candle, we can sweep that lows. So that's going to be the good positive and good, uh, good and positive uh, take for EPL. A negative, if we will see something like this one, take profit and only after that uh, drop to that low because we're going to waste the time. So guys, uh, now we try and hold the line around the buy line. A 12 hour time frame, we'll take a look. Uh, we can go and retest the buy line again. And I, re I remind you, with a weak candle, we can sweep that low. Uh, $8.03 three, and uh, for the amount of value, it's $6.00. So all targets I showed you, uh, globally, yes, I'm bullish on uh, RPL. So bullish one targets, I showed you uh, around 92, uh, $138 per token. And I recommend you track the data and the fundraising rounds uh, that bakers, you know, who invested in that token. Because I think uh, the Coinbase Venture not uh, invest randomly, right? I hope, I hope. So guys, I hope you like this video. If you would like to trade with my customer request, I will show it in this video. Just write me DM, subscribe channel, hit the like button, hit the notification button. Don't forget to join my Telegram channel. See you next time, guys.